What's up guys, Johnny here back with more Shadowgun Legends. The Halloween event is almost over guys. It's scheduled to end tomorrow morning at the time I'm posting this video. So we have about um, a day left to collect the three new weapons. Uh, Pazuzu SMG is the one you see uh, in the gameplay right now. But a pretty good rewards this event. It lasted a whole two weeks. I don't know if you guys got good perks. Uh, leave me a comment below i'm curious to see what you guys got but um the vampire skiss sniper is pretty interesting uh i see lots of good comments it's pretty good for real uh the ar is also very nice by the way it's what i said yesterday it's like in between uh, nico and the skull blaster uh, if you check the stats very very interesting ar uh so it's your last chance guys to grab these uh new weapons before the event is over and in today's video um we will see uh, the information I have on the new events scheduled to start tomorrow, which is uh, a PvP event again. So PvP event number four. I don't have a name for it. I don't know if it's uh, PvP Madness Volume 4. But I'm pretty sure they said PvP Madness was a trilogy last time and the Volume 3 was the last one. So anyways, it's a different event this time. And uh, usually I have lots of information on Fridays about the upcoming events but this time i have uh not much for real guys not much to share i will still share uh, all i have with you guys starting with the um event description maybe so here we go nitro will have a small repeatable chain quest waiting for the players for the duration of this event it will activate for players who have already unlocked team pvp which is rank five so most of you guys watching this video right now pretty sure you already rank five right so when you come back uh, at nitros you should have some missions or chain quest probably will uh, will be uh, when you click on nitro you usually have missions already for uh, arena and stuff so check it out tomorrow now about the rewards it says rewards for completing the quests are fame and war point so it's gonna be another thing you can repeat over and over again for the duration of the event and you will be able to farm more fame but also war points or war coins i don't remember the exact term so we'll say war points still but war points uh, you never have too many uh there's a pretty nice set right now available just waiting for good perks but of course the liberator smg you can get which is uh pretty expensive so we'll keep farming points all of the quests are accompanied by lore surrounding nitro and tnt i have no idea who tnt is but i know some of you guys know i'm pretty sure and they said on the past mad stream it has to do with uh, a character from shadowgun dead zone i think but you guys can confirm in the comments who the hell is tnt guys it will reveal some more world's lore Whatever that means, not sure about that. World's lore. Uh, but yeah, more more story. More Shadowgun Legends or Shadowgun Universe story. So what else we got? Last piece of information I have. Rewards for this event. Sticker and cosmetic. The cosmetic is Disc Head. What the hell is Disc Head? Um, in the past, well, in the past events, most uh, cosmetic we had were reskins. I can think of a few right now, a couple of reskins for cosmetic hats. Um, disc head, we did talk a bit on chat yesterday and the day before. Uh, it could be the Raiden hat, maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's gonna be the, the Raiden kind of hat, which is the one that looks the most like a disc to me. But hey, could be anything. We never know. Mad Figure Games, maybe they have a surprise for us tomorrow. We will see. Let me know in the comments what you think is going to happen tomorrow. Disc head cosmetic sticker. But most of all, uh, more fame, more war coins or war points. And uh, yeah, like I don't know about you guys' reaction to that. Uh, it's always cool to have new weapons, new armor. So the, the rewards are a bit maybe smaller than what we're used to. Uh, just the sticker and the cosmetic hat. But again, like there's already a new shop at Nitro and most, I know a lot of guys are still farming coins to get the Liberator and the new armor. I, I know I need, I need a bunch of coins right now. So 
It's not bad. It will revive PvP again a little bit. I'm pretty sure. I know I will play PvP on stream this week. So, yeah, that's it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more Shadowgun Legends news, gameplay, and guys, I'll be back soon. Take care. Watch my other videos. Bye-bye.